Um, hey guys, remember the plan we've got going on right now where we don't spread the fire around to other parts of the ship? Good morning, everyone. Dave from the Wee Hours here, back with some more of Stardust, where things are going surprisingly well, and it's making me very, very nervous. Our new crafting room is all set down here. We've got furnaces going, producing gold ingots, because we're going to be rich beyond all possible dreams of avarice. Not with gold, but with uranium. We're trading in uranium right now. Speaking of trading in uranium, where are we? Okay, so we just kind of looted that station and took them for everything they've got. Let's go over to Cathburnhard. Have we, have we been there before? Not actually 100% sure. And where is Gorin? I've got to keep an eye on, on Gorin at all. Where did Gorin go? I need to know where... There it is. Oh, thank God. Okay, that's where I'm getting all of my stuff. My uranium, my silver, everything is over there. Now, what I wouldn't actually mind grabbing is some fundamental rocks. We're a little low on that. Now, there's rocks over here. I don't remember if somebody owns that. How about Contra 4? Do we know nothing about Contra 4? Let's go check out Contra 4. And Zippy Boop over here constructing my new drone. I wore my new thingamajiggy there, my new uh, construction bot there. It's a little bit of a slow process. Zippy Boop's moving on it. He's very dedicated to this task of making a new friend. But yeah, we're going to have a new robot up and running fairly soon. And I've got a machine that transports, or transfers rather, human brains into robots. I'm just, you know, doing some light mathematics here. I've, I'm going to have a new robot. And I've got humans who have got human brains that can go into a robot. Wait, are you my new robot? You're my new robot. What are you making over here then? Oh, I just needed one of these, dude. Why are you making another one? Huh, that's kind of weird. Did I tell you to keep doing that until you're done with it? Maybe I did. I don't know. Well, keep doing what you're doing. You're doing great work, Zippy Boo. Uh, but yeah, you, you here, you, you're missing some stuff, aren't you? Let's see if we can replace irreparable. I should have all the things I need for that. I'm not quite sure why I've got two of these going on right now. Maybe it just, does it make them until I tell them to stop making them? That's entirely possible. Like, Surgeon, you've got a brain, right? You've got a perfectly good human brain in here. Not doing anything but you know, moving your body around and thinking and being self-aware. How, just for, just for having a conversation, so don't walk away from me, just for having the conversation, how cool would you be if I ripped your brain out and put it in a robot? Well, we've pulled in to Contra 4. Let's see what's going on at Contra 4 here. Okay, we've got a station, got some coal, got some ice. Neat. Does that belong to anyone? Uh, does not look like it does. Cool. And what's going on? What is what is that? And what what's the what's the moon here? Doesn't really seem to have anything. Um, let's go. Let's do this. Let's go grab some ice. So travel over there. Grab some ice, and then we'll make a trip over to the station and see what's going on there. I might grab some coal on my way out the door because that'll just save me making coal out of rocks. Anything else here? Some copper up there. That's not a bad idea, but there's actually quite a few copper deposits locally. We, we don't need to stress that one right now. Ice I will take though. So let's launch an expedition here. Who's going out? Colton. Yep, that's a good choice. Freya, definitely. Bubo and Surgeon are a little sad, but go ahead and do it anyway. Launch that expedition, please. Yep, Freya, you can just take a break from that. Zippy Boop will come in and deal with this. Now, anyone who's left on the ship, like Jesse, Jesse, come here. Uh, show me, please, your equipment. Do I have any more firearms? Oh, he's too low AI. Um, Jesse, go do some R&R &R right now. Can I get in a feel for... Okay, so Amaya, Bubo, Fowler, and Olympia will obey my commands. Um, Olympia, you're you're new here, and again, you, you have a human brain that I, I could theoretically rip out. Uh, Olympia, where are you? You said you were over here. Don't lie to me, Olympia. Oh, you're in bed. Okay. So, equipment. Can I give you a firearm? No, just knives. I thought I made more of those. Where, where, well, where might I have put them? The weapons locker is where I would have put them, Dave. Do you remember where the weapons locker is, Dave? Not really. You don't, do you, kid? Found it. Okay, so what's in here? Uh, two knives. Okay. 
I thought I made more firearms. I would have sworn I made more firearms. Um, I might be a little low on just like microchips and stuff like that. So what are we making over here? We're making some gold wire and we were making plastic, but we've done it. How about we shut that off and can we make somewhere in a handgun? Titanium plate, that's oh, the platinum ingots. I can make one, really. And I need some lead plate too. I'll go up to the furnace and make that at some point. Okay, make, just make one. That's fine. Uh, just, just, that's all. No, no, yeah, that's all I can do. So just make the one of those, please. Yeah, if I could find some platinum in the reasonably near future, that'd be great. Or buy it, because I've got a lot of uranium that I can be selling right now. So, I, I'm a little fuzzy on this. I've got drone here and drone here. What do you think you're doing right now? You're assembling a construction drone. All right, how about you stop doing that? I think it's just, it's like, all, oh, I've told them I want 11. No, no, stop that, man. Stop, stop doing that. Uh, what else can I make in here? I can make some plastic while I'm here. Uh, advanced microchips actually would be better. What do I need for that? Improved microchip. I've got 16 of those. Optical fiber and gold wire. Let's say we try to have like five of those. Just, just. Don't go crazy with it, but just make five at any given moment. Now, you guys here, can we, if I say replace irreparable, I know you don't have a brain. I get that part. But could we replace the rest of your bits and then I can kind of figure it out from there? So I know you don't have a core. We're all, we're going to work on that. It's all going to be fine. But let's just try and repair what you've got and then we can kind of figure it out from there. You know what, that's probably enough ice, guys. You can come ahead, you go ahead and come back with that. 244 chunks of ice. That's a perfectly fine amount to get. And then when they get back, we're going to swing over to that station and see what's going on over there. And then maybe jet somewhere else. Okay, what have you guys got in here? And what's your faction, by the way? What, what, who are you? Yeah, make, make all of that go away. Make it go away. Make it go away. Okay. You've got 38,000. Well, I can clean you out immediately. And what we learned, of course, from our last money experiment is it seems to be quantity of money that will boost up rep. Let's start with the easy stuff. What have you got? Do you have, you've got platinum ingots. You got a lot of them too. Boy, you got a lot of platinum ingots. How about just raw platinum? Yeah, because that'd be, well, I say it'd be cheaper. It's actually it's not that much cheaper. Platinum ingot is 10, and the raw platinum is 8. And you only got two of them anyway. Seems to me it'd be smarter just to buy the platinum ingots. Uh, apart from my excessive amount of radioactive materials, what would you be interested in buying? Uh, you will buy uranium, right? Oh yeah, you love uranium. 2.9k, that's actually not a great price for that. I think I could do better. Silver, very cheap. Wow, they're not into... Uh, they're not getting to give any kind of good prices on any of this, are they? Do you have anything interesting? Uh, raw materials, water, shuttle drill upgrade. Oh, you've got some handguns. I can just buy them. I mean, you've only got the one, but I will buy that. Uh, let's work with some, maybe some platinum ingots here. So how about I got uh, 10 of them? I, you've got a ton of uranium, man. How about just five? And then I'm going to sell you like all of this uranium. So for 31 uranium out of my 628 I've got right now, I can get five plat. You know what? Get more pla get more platinum ingots, man. Get more of these. I just, just get them all. Just trade everything until they are bankrupt and we've got a lot of platinum ingots. So get up to, yeah, there we go. 36K back to us, 50 uranium, and I can go get more right now. And we're getting a handgun out of this. Execute that trade. Oh, I did an achievement for that. I got 100,000 star credits. Yay, I'm rich. I don't know if there's much else I want here. I'd actually really like to go get some rocks. We'll probably just... Although I do kind of want to check everything out. Not just go back to the place I know has rocks. I'd rather go kind of poodle around and see what's going on around here. I don't think we're making any more progress on these guys. We seem to have just sort of stopped with that. So shoulders, arms, hands. I am missing a battery, a, obviously a core. Shoulders, arms, and hands. Huh. Is this my uh, parts storage? No, that's my mechaware. Where's my parts storage? Show me what I've got in here. Uh, show me storage. Ooh, yeah. Boy, I am low on stuff, aren't I? I guess I've used a lot of it to build those two drones. Hmm. 
okay, well, you know what? Somebody will have something for sale, and I bet they'll pay in uranium. Now, while we're heading out, let's look at some research here. I might, I might want to be boring and actually look at research that I'm supposed to be researching, like, you know, defenses and flight and that kind of thing. So if I wanted to look at, like, there's, oh, we're leaving Contra 4, that's fine. Um, if I wanted to look at, like, shielding, you know, so we don't get hit by meteors when they come by. What am I looking at here? Space travel. Is it in there? Thruster efficiency, the shuttle, short-range teleportation, local maneuvering. All right, so there's... There's tighter control when we're about to get hit by a giant rock. How about we just didn't get hit by the rock in the first place? I see tractor beam. Target marker. Build this when you want incoming and... Oh. Oh, that's it. Hang on, hang on. Build this where you want incoming objects to land. Ah, so would this work with raiders? So I see the tractor beam. Guide some flying objects towards the selected tractor beam target. Could I do this with a raider pod? Could I hit it with the tractor beam and then put it down, you know, basically in the cold, heartless vacuum of space and let them rot out there? Interesting. Um, again, let's go back to the concept of not getting hit by meteors. The autopilot upgrade, I'm, I need more high-tech datoids for that, and I know I've been told many, 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 many times about getting autopilot in here. I know somewhere up in here, there's shielding of some sort. I'm just kind of struggling to find it. Ah, oh, it's way, way, way down here. Yeah, it's all the way down in force fields. I'm not seeing that for a while. There's a lot I'm going to have to go through to get into that. I'm going to go all the way to, oh, wow. So many things that I do not have for this. What do I, oh, this is all dependent on door permissions. Really? I've been avoiding that one for so long. Okay, unlock door permissions. Yay! Yeah, I can't I can't not look at things I haven't looked at yet. We're going over to Genua. I know there's rocks. Right? There's like two different planets that have rocks on them. And I'm going to go where the potentially the rocks aren't because I don't know what's here and I want to know what's here. Okay, what do we got going on? In, oh, a meteor. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang Whoa, all, whoa, whoa, whoa. All sorts of things are happening. It's a meteoroid shower. Stay. Okay, breach. Bre okay, fine. Fine. I, hang on. Everything just stop. Everything just stop. Okay? What are... I don't know what that is. What have I got here? Incoming breach capsule and a meteoroid shower. Okay, that's, that's where the fires come from. Can we just try and leave? Can we just... Can we just go? I'd, I'd like... I'd, well, you don't have the... The fine-tuned piloting, do you, kid? Uh, what is in here while I'm here? Wait, is that more uranium? Has anyone claimed it? Oh my god, there's more uranium over here. And titanium. I, I, I could have some titanium. I'd be okay with that. No actual rocks. which is And an unknown. I do love the unknown. Go to unknown. Let's find out what that is. Travel over there. It might help us to avoid the meteor shower. I Probably it will not. And we should also address the, the breach capsule issue. Uh, which is incoming, like right now. Yeah, me meteoroids are coming, guys. Yeah, lots of them. L lots, lots and lots of them. Could we maybe, like, literally go anywhere else right now? Oh, this is gonna be grim. Okay, uh, batten down the hatches. I, I think that's a sailing thing. Uh, there we go, we're out. Oh, we're still, we're gonna, we're flying. No, guys, we're flying into the meteors now. We're flying directly into the meteors at this point. They're, they're coming straight for us, guys. That one will probably miss us. These two definitely will not. Those, those are going to be harsh. Okay, that's a thing. And that's a thing. Okay, that's actually not that bad. We can cope with those two. Have we missed broadly the rest? No, we haven't missed this one. That's the breach capsule. Okay, breaching is still happening. Breaching is okay. I just wanted to do some mining and trading today. I really... Really just want to do... Okay, there's there's more fires. Good. Um, hey, guys, remember the plan we've got going on right now where we don't spread the fire around to other parts of the ship? I just... Wait, Gollum? Who the heck is Gollum? Ah, Gollum Potato. Okay, okay. Apparently we found a core from somewhere. Somebody put Gollum Potato together. Also, I am never, ever changing this name. Just when you think Zippy Boop can't be the top of the line, all of a sudden you've got Gollum Potato. 
why are more people not playing this game? Um, Gollum. So we've got kind of a loose working plan where we don't spread fire to other parts of the ship. I don't know if you've been briefed on that yet because you're brand new. Uh, but the team does seem to be yeah, getting the job done down here. We're going to have to replace this wall super quick, guys. Uh, but yeah, if we could, um, could maybe put out the fire. Yeah, Cassandra and Frankie are in here on it. Uh, there's more fire. Where, where? Okay, yes, that's the fire I'm already aware of. I know about that fire. Tell me about different fire. Let's 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 move things up a little bit here. Where did that breach capsule go? I'm mildly concerned about that. It it doesn't appear to have actually breached anything. Um, how are you guys doing on the fire down here? Yeah, you, you basically got that under control. Okay, good job, team. Uh, we need yeah, Cassandra. I think it's done, Cassandra. Thank you. Yeah, you you got it, kid. Good 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 job there. Let's start to put that back together. So, um, show me again. Uh, the wall still exists. Okay, good. So let's do a floor here, and then I'll kind of put those walls back in there. So walls go... No, no, this is not what you want to look at. Walls go here and here, and then I'll do the other one when they get the floor up. Okay. Um, how about that whole... Uh, the whole breach capsule? Did we... Were we breached at some point? I don't seem to see any breaching. What, what are you? Are you the breach capsule? No, you're coffee. Well, we're at unknown here, and, and Gollum Potato is just working working his butt off here. Just brand new. He's moving some water around for reasons that aren't adequately explained. Uh, but he's, he's moving some water around. We've made a handgun at some point. Um, Gollum Potato, how would you like to be heavily armed? You got a knife right now. How about you equip... Why do we only have knives? Are other people picking them up? Are they like, oh, there's a firearm there. I'm going to go grab that firearm. Maybe they're just grabbing them because we clearly made it. We Oh, combat's in progress. Um, uh, We've been breached. The breaching has happened. Could we um, could we, could we, we see the breaching, please? Uh, where, where is combat happening? It looks like one group of scavengers somewhere. Where, where is this where's this occurring where, what is the problem here oh they're up here okay got him yeah there's six of them um yeah they ain't nothing they ain't nothing here madeline madeline if you die could you try to make sure that your brain is intact because i will resurrect you into a robot uh let's get we got we got we need everybody up here so get all the team up here and frankly anyone that i can control is coming up here so, yeah, everybody... Oh, Madeline got a gun. Madeline, you picked up a firearm. Uh, shoot anyone. I don't care. Just, just literally shoot anyone. Uh, try not to die. And again, if you do, if you could leave your brain intact, uh, that'd be... Amaya got a gun. So they're just they're just picking them up by themselves. Um, Amaya, why don't you just uh, shoot Zat here? Oh, Zat's already incapacitated. That, that already happened. Um, how about we go for Doctor? You want to shoot Doctor? Madeline, just run until the rest of the team gets here. Because I don't have a lot of solutions for this right now. Yeah, Amaya just kind of circling Doctor here. Uh, Doctor, explain this to me. How have you not fallen into space? How, how are you standing there? How have you not fallen into the cold, heartless vacuum of space? Okay, what else is going on? Ooh, Java's armed. Uh, like, you know, with a, with a gun gun. Uh, so shoot Java instead. And Madeline, could you also... I think Madeline's just booking it. Yeah, Matt, her sanity is only 59%. She's probably not paying attention to me anymore. Uh, Killer Mark, just not playing. Yeah, Killer Mark is, is just bashing Doctor. So is Cassandra. Um, okay, I need to call everyone's attention. Team, team watching at home, I need to call everyone's attention to the fact that Java is a cleaning bot with a gun. So what that means is I can give Brian a gun. I did not think the cleaning bots could be armed. Now I know they can. I'm going to make Brian into a death Roomba. Okay, enough of that. Back to work here. Um, Project, you love killing things. What are you armed with right now? Yeah, you got a handgun. Uh, why don't you focus on, like, Java? Uh, <laughs> the cleaning robot is weirdly the most dangerous thing in this room right now. Um, yeah, just go ahead. And, there we go. Okay, you're, you've chosen to headbutt them. That's an odd choice. Uh, but hey, whatever you're into, kid. Um, Amaya's in. Olympia's also found a gun. So they're just picking them up. They're probably like, the gun is better than the knife. Therefore, I will autonomously go get one of those. 
Uh, Olympia, you want to like... Oh, Doctor's already down. Brian's down. Excuse me. Brain is down. No combat. Did we... Oh, we've taken care of everything. Okay. Um, great. Release them and release them. Now. Now, 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 now. Who's got a brain for me? <sighs> They're going to be raider brains, though. That's the problem. Uh, you, Keenan, short Keenan, who is dead. You appear to be very dead. How's your brain? Yeah, your brain's done. Okay, so you were just going to eat. Um, Java. Java, you've got... Oh, you're, you're saying you technically don't have any equipment. I know for a fact you're a Roomba with a gun, which is the most exciting thing I've said this morning. Uh, let's disassemble you. Okay, any of the robots that are dead, let's let's disassemble them because we might be able to get parts that we need. So Zat, um, you're like, what have you got left? You got a lot of stuff left. You got a lot of stuff that. So disassemble Zat, Gollum, Potato, coming in here. I love everything that you're doing for me right now. Okay, let's just have everyone kind of get back to normal for a few seconds, and then anyone else like uh, Brain. Brain, talk to me about your brain. I mean, it's right there in the title. Yeah, see, your human brain is still very active. Very, very active. I was told in comments, by the way, thank you to thank you to the comments section. I was because everyone was saying, oh, sell the raider brains, sell the evil brains to somebody, uh, and you'll make money. And I'm like, I've got raider brains, nobody wants to buy them. Apparently, I've got to get into the black market for that. So it may surprise people to know that even in the future. When we think it will be, you know, a paradise, a utopia, even in the future, you do have to get a little shady to sell a human brain to somebody. So let's just remove everything. Okay, just get everything off of there, including your brain. Uh, Simon, same gig with you. So show me. Uh, order remove all on you. Okay, anyone else? Doctor, yeah, you, you vaguely survived this. So remove everything from you. And then we've got all them processed. Then we'll, you know, kind of get on the whole eating you. And then disassemble the breach capsule. There's always good stuff in there. Always. Brian, you are so going to be armed. It's going to be magnificent. All right, I think we actually weathered that fairly well. That that seemed to go okay, especially with everyone being armed now. Yeah, they, they're obviously just autonomously picking up weapons. I'm sure it's just a one thing is better than the other. I'm sure if I got energy weapons, they'd probably start trading out all of those. Wow, we got a lot going on down here. Yeah, Killer Mark and Cassandra need a little bit of a patch job there. That, that's fine. We can take care of that. Uh, we've done our advanced microchips here, which is good. Uh, where did we actually go? What was the whole point of this? Uh, right, we're going to unknown. Okay, let's... Right, you just had a raid, dude. Do you really want to send these people out? And the answer is actually give them some R&R &R first. Because nobody's really in a good, sh good shape for that. And an incoming stasis pod, too. Wow, it's... um. It's a busy time around the old ship today. It's a busy old time. Everyone's popping by to say hi. You move to a new neighborhood, everyone's popping by. That thing's about to pop wide open. So what exactly what exactly do we got here? Is it crawlers? Is it a kitty? Is it is wait, a stasis pod willing to trade? What does that mean? What do you got? Oh, it's these guys. Huh. Okay, I'm certainly willing to look at that. What have you got? Because I got a lot of uranium. I have so much uranium right now. You got some lithium. Weirdly, I wouldn't mind getting some of that because I don't have a lot of it. You got some energy efficiency upgrades I could plug into people. How about you got some platinum ingots? They're, again, they're pricey. But I can afford this kind of stuff now. How about we get another five of those? Okay, I'm going to take your two efficiency upgrades. And I'm going to take, like, all of your lithium, just because I don't feel like I have a lot of that. Uh, do I have a lot of that? Are you willing to trade in lithium? Yeah, I don't think I've even got any. Do I have... I've got 21. Yeah, that's not very many. So, yeah, I think that that's a good trade. We'll, we'll definitely get that. Ooh, I could just grab your coffee. I'll grab all of your petroleum for no readily explicable reason other than I want to have it. Mini cell. I, I don't have any of those. Let's get one of those. It's only 651. You know what? Get the arm socket, too. Okay. How much uranium can I sell to you for that? What are you, what are you giving for silver ingots these days? 
1.29K. Yeah, those are just not selling for as much as I anticipated they would. Ooh, your price on uranium is way down. That is not a lot of uranium. Okay, I'm going to sell you... Actually, the silver ingots might be a little more valuable. Not really, though. Not really. The, the platinum ingots are valuable, but that's what I want. Gold ingots. How about we sell five of these? Okay, and then... That's what you're making gold wire out of, though, Dave. No, don't sell those. You actually need those, and gold is kind of hard to come by unless you're going to get a bunch of rocks. Okay, uranium it is. You know what? If necessary, we'll go back to Gorn and get some more uranium. There we go. 55 uranium, and I get all of that stuff. So execute that trade, and my standing with them went up. So they're the old Earth faction. All right, so I went up a little bit with them. I'm a Grand total of 1% with them. Yay, and there goes their pod. Thank you, thank you for coming by and visiting. And just in case over here, let's uh, set up a, just a little repair square over there. There's a few pieces of floor that could use a little attention. How are people thinking for the old expedition? You guys feeling a little bit better? Um, not really, not really. Uh, take out Colton, take out Surgeon, Bubo will go. Let's put in I'm not really sure. Let's put in maybe... Yeah, put in Gollum. Put in Gollum. He can't do anything. He's terrible at everything. Uh, but he's great. He's got a fun name. So off you go, guys. Go find out what lives over there. Some of my crew members are too tired. Oh, Bubo's too tired now. Uh, okay, send it out now. Just two robots. That'll be terrible. What do you got going on over there, guys? An artifact. Uh, yeah, sure. Definitely recover that. It's only a 2% chance of failure. That is totally fine. So we'll see what that is. It may be interesting. It may not be. What'd you guys get? Pop out. What'd you get? You got... Oh, coffee! 141 coffee! Wow! That's like my dream come true. Oh, wait a minute. I don't need to go anywhere to get uranium. There's uranium right here. Let's go check out this signal. Go, go see what's going on over there. And then we'll just mine some more uranium to make up for all the stuff I've been buying today. And then... Then what? And what, maybe make a little bit more money over on the station here and then push on somewhere else, possibly. So what exactly is your deal here? Respond to your signal. Okay. Artisan mentions they gladly part with this incredible piece, a handcrafted object, for a mere 11,000? This is probably some... It's going to be a duck, isn't it? It's going to be a duck. I bet you it's a duck. You know what, 11,000, I can make that in a snap. I will do it. All right, what is it? Oh, crude oil. That's actually not that bad. 171 crude oil. That's pretty good. I don't know how you call that art, but I'll take it. Um, uranium time. Hey, you know what I've never researched? Batteries. Just, I've got the one battery since day one. That's all we've ever had around here. Well, that that's an idea. Where could I... And maybe throw in some batteries. That seems like a fun thing to have. Um, uh, battery? Okay, what does it take to, uh... Well, it doesn't matter what it takes to make it. I'll figure it out as we go along. Let's put two batteries over there. All right, and Cassandra's already on it. She's such a trooper like that. What's your problem? Oh, that's the loom. Yeah, we don't really, don't really do that much with the loom. You're doing petroleum. I think we're going to be fine with all of that. I've got 106 units of uranium right now, which is more than what I've spent today, so I'm already in great shape in terms of profit and loss. And that's probably an excellent place to call it on Star Deus for today. Again, it's, I'd like to say it's surprisingly quiet. It hasn't been. We got hit by meteors and then there was a raid, but we seem to have dealt with those fairly well. We've come out of that just fine. I'm very suspicious now. I feel like something horrible is going to happen. But guys, we'll call it on Star Deus for today. We'll come back with some more of this again next time. Do please keep the comments coming in. Let me know what you're thinking of this. And hey, if you enjoyed the video, do please leave a like down below. It does cheer me up. No end when people do that. And if you're new to the channel, maybe just checking it out for the first time, feel free to hit that subscribe button. See more of this ridiculous nonsense. Until then, I'm Dave. Thank you, as always, for joining me in the wee hours, and we'll see you next time. You know, an argument could have been made that spending an obscene amount of money on researching the theater just so I can get a sign that says Electric Boogie Lou may not have been my smartest move. That is a strong argument, and that's an argument that you'd probably win, frankly. Wow, naked guy sticks his hand in a beehive. This, this can't end well. I don't know where I would see a leather carpet 
but I'm going to imagine I have to pay an entry fee to see it. I have a cylinder. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. I, I broke Dave. <laughs> broke Dave. <laughs> uh, talk about yourselves, I'll be back. <laughs> I just dropped my controller. <laughs> oh my goodness.